Hello, we're the Acres. I'm Dave, and this is Crystal. Well, during COVID and the pandemic, we were watching church online, and we went to Papa Rob's for like a fun outing as a family, and we went there a lot, actually. <laughs> and we loved the place, and we were looking on Facebook, and we'd heard of Sojo before, but we saw that Sojo was actually having services in the parking lot of Papa Rob's. And so we were like, whoa, that's super cool. We can get out of the house, not have to watch church online. And we... And we can get free ice cream. <laughs> can get some free ice cream. I mean, the Holy Spirit was drawing me into that sun drop shake <laughs> and just made me keep coming back for more. You know, we hear um, in scripture that Jesus died for us while we were still sinners. And so we didn't have to like have it all together or be perfect in order to come into the church um, or to be loved and accepted by Jesus. And we felt that at Sojo that we didn't, ex they didn't expect everybody to be perfect or have it all together. It was just people who really loved Jesus and they were real. Um, life is hard. And um, there were so many different people from different walks of life. And um, just, it felt like family to us. I was looking for a healthy, discipleship-focused, <laughs> mission-driven church with about 300 people. And when I looked around, there was about 300 people here. So I knew that this was the place for us. But seriously, we were really looking for a place for our family to be connected and to really connect with other people and also be able to serve. We wanted a church where we could serve and um, show our kids how we could uh, be a part of a church and help others come to see Jesus. We feel like Jesus is keeping us here um, so that we can be connected and just have the family that we have at Sojo. I think for me it's the different opportunities to serve and also just seeing the church grow. Mm -hmm. You know, going from the Sojo uh, uh, Papa Rob's that we were at to this bare church without any walls or paint on it to now um, having classrooms for the kids and the youth to go to and having that midweek and just having that experience to be able to uh, interact with our church family during the week. And that it's a community with a cause, you know? I mean, that we're continually trying to love on the community um, as a body. That's huge for us too. You know, not expecting people just to come here, but we're out and about, you know, sharing the gospel and sharing love. We just saw the movie last night, Jesus Revolution. <laughs> so seeing that energy happen here, uh, to the point where we have to open other churches, where we have to open China Grove, and we are able to open the Locust location, you know, be able to just uh, fill the house, fill God's house.